Hi, Sharon Downey with Two Minute Tips for Healthy Beauty and Confident Aging. This week it's the side pony with my straight hair with a slight bend to it and a triple layered extension with dark, light, and dark. So first I'm going to part my hair as I usually do from the temple to the temple and around to the back and then I'm going to clip it out of the way. Next, I'm going to make another part from the center of the crown on a diagonal towards the right hand side because I'm going to wear the pony to the left hand side. So now I'm going to clip that extension in right along that part line. And what I love about putting an extension in sideways like this is it layers the ends when it hangs down. So next I'm going to take the hairs I usually do on my crown and back comb it with my brush and I'm just going to do it as I usually do taking sections and I mostly do it at the root you know anywhere from three to six strokes and then when I come down towards the sides I go right out to the end because the sides are going to be uh, filled in a little bit more so I need a little bit more moldability which is the other thing that backcombing does is it allows you to mold the hair into the shape that you want. Okay, now I'm going to check the back as I usually do and do you see how long that extension is? It just adds the extra length that I need but I don't need it throughout the rest of my hair. Just in the center back works just fine. So now I'm going to smooth down the hair over top and for the sides because my hair is very thin I'm going to add an extension on each side just short I don't need it any longer than you know what it is showing there so I just clip it in place and put my own hair over top and it's close to my own hair color so it matches beautifully and I also put these in on an angle as well smooth it together then I start by grabbing it all and I'm going to start doing a twist and I'm going to turn the hair and twist it over the top. Grab more hair at the bottom, twist it up and over the top. Grab more hair on the bottom, twist it up and over the top. Now I'm coming into those long pieces. Twist it and grab it and lift it over the top. It's a little bit challenging separating the hair, but not too bad. Now I just simply turn around to the front. I could clip that back piece in place, but I'm used to working with it. And then I just do the same thing in the front. Pull the two pieces together, and then I simply use a claw clip. Now you, there's any number of clips you can use, but I like the size of these. You could also use, um, you know, an elastic of some kind, and then you put your you know, bow or whatever it is you're going to use in afterwards. You're, but you just want to make sure it's secure enough. And then I'm going to use my barber comb to lift the hair where I need it lifted, hold it, and then spray it and hold it for a second. I find that that's an easy way to lift the hair and have it stay there. Rather than lift, it falls back down and spray it. So that's a good little trick. So now there's a number of things you can do with this pony. You can either leave it or you can separate it and continue to work with the, the rope that it's, that's what it's called is a rope. And you can rope it all the way down if that's what you want to do so that it just continues right on down. Or you can take it apart and maybe put in a well, what, a braid. Try that and see how that looks. And in the process, my own hair is a little bit shorter, of course, than the extension. But because all the hair is layered, it doesn't show up very much. And it all just kind of blends in really nicely. So here I am doing a braid. 
you can take that braid and you can put it up over top, make a chignon out of it, any number of things. But I'm just going to leave it as is, comb the hair through and make sure. And then I'm going to take a pick and just back comb the end of it a little bit and back comb my own hair into the extension so it just blends a little bit better. It looks just slightly messy, which is perfect. So a nice long pony for a nice change of pace. And here we have the back in that rope shape joined together at the side, fairly easy. And then you just pull and smoosh as you usually do, fix it the way you want, and there you are. Thicker and longer and oh so chic. See you next time.